Goodbye, Mr. Meat. Oh, don't worry. None of you will go to waste, except for that useless brain of yours. <laughs> I've had quite enough of you sticking your nose where it doesn't belong. If you attempt to escape, I shall have no choice but to kill you. And this time, Philip, you will stay dead forever. Now! Turn around! I've had quite enough of you sticking your nose where it doesn't belong. If you attempt to escape, I shall have no choice but to kill you. And this time, Philip, you will stay dead forever. Now! Turn around! My greatest creation. This will most certainly hurt you much more than me. Goodbye. <laughs> You are brilliant, yes, but you are also a careless, selfish, irresponsible drunk, always blaming someone for something when the real problem is you. You're pathetic. Just a little bit further. Philip! Help! I'm stuck! I can't go any further! The beast must have cut Sarah in half. But perhaps I could find the parts that are left. Good God. What am I thinking? How could I even consider using a devil's tool like Energy L to bring her back? Why can't I too escape through death? It's all the doctor's fault. He will pay. You should have stayed dead, child killer! You've interfered long enough! You've interfered long enough! He is right. I do not deserve to live. You disgusting creature! Trapped. There must be a way out of here. I know you are in there. There's no escaping, you beast.
die a pig. Ah, what is that hideous thing? So ugly. Ah! There, in the shadows, something is moving. Quickly, I need something to throw. Ah, a rock. Friend, like, like he, like, like you. you. Poor dirt. He's harmless. He scares people by the way he looks, just like me. Maybe that's why I understand him. Philip, I'm in the hall. Yeah. <laughs>